Certainly. Um, I'm sitting in the driver's seat right now, so this person is usually responsible for driving in really nasty weather conditions. Um, next to him is the navigator, and the navigator is trying to get us the best path to, to the tornado. Um, so he has monitors that he's looking at, um, both with our radar data and also usually with mapping stuff. But then in back, my favorite part, um, the way back is my really favorite part. Um, so that's where I sit, and that's where a lot of the radar controls and all that are located. Um, so squish back there. And then over here we have mission control, so usually Josh is sitting here, and he's usually coordinating a lot of the other vehicles in the experiment, so he has a lot of monitors because he's taking in a lot of information. Because it's fun. Um, it really is. There's a lot of knowledge that you can gain still from yes. tornadoes and lightning and see we have another yes. one. Meet CEO Otis. <laughs> we have a budding uh, scientist here, so he's just he's gonna design a plane to find a tornado. You are. Why do you want to be a storm chaser, Eli? Because it's cool to see these strong strong tornadoes coming down into the ground and on the ground and making a lot of damage. I'm usually operating this radar that we're in here, Dow 7, um, so just making sure it's up and functional and collecting all the data that we need. And then also I coordinate the pod team, so we have this array of pods that we try to put in the path of the tornado, so once the tornado is formed, um, I'm trying to find a good location for them to go and for them to actually deploy their pods, so good multitasking. Well, my least favorite part is the lack of windows, I can tell you that right away. <laughs> but my favorite part really is the radar, because um, we get a lot of cool data with it, and all these yeah, screens have examples of all our cool data, and he's impressed by our data, so... You are impressed by our data. It has to be that good. So... I think my most exciting experience, I put that in air quotes, uh, was actually the first time I did a hurricane mission. Um, because a lot of the tornado missions, you're actually, well, all of them, you're outside of the tornado. But in the hurricanes, you actually drive up to the coast and you let the hurricane overtake you. Um, so that was actually a very interesting mission to experience, you know, hurricane force winds um, for the first time in a radar truck. <laughs> Because it's a really fun movie, it shows um, a lot of people that are very passionate about weather, it shows the photographers trying to get awesome shots, it shows all the scientists out there in Vortex 2 who really are passionate about getting weather data, and there's lots of good weather footage, so people who like to just look at tornadoes and hail and wind um, should come see it as well.